how are you today? Now, I just want to do this quick video. First and foremost, Canada, are you guys okay over there? Guys, Canada just had five earthquakes within the past three hours. These quakes were between 4.0 to 4.7, back to back to back to back to back. It wasn't on the land mass of Canada. It was actually at the shoreline. Now, this is where I get worried now. This is the Cascade subduction zone. It's starting to move, okay? And this is why Canada is getting hit, right, guys? That subduction zone right there is where one plate meet the other and it push over. And right there, you can have what is called mega thrust earthquake can go up to like 9.0 if it ever pop. It's moving right now, but I'm not saying it's going to pop. Let me tell you what's going to happen. It's going to trigger. I mean, I know California get earthquake, but California, you guys, is going to magnify the quakes that are happening now in California. The subduction zone is waking up because Canada is getting hit like crazy. So what that will do that vibration will actually amplify those quakes that are now happening in California. So California, the quakes that you guys are going to be getting for the next few days, you're going to see a lot of 4.0s, okay? There's some 4.0s coming. California has been getting a lot of 2.7, 2.3, 2.0, but the 4s are about to kick up. And it's because of the Cascade subduction zone, folks. It's moving. And Canada, head on a swivel, because if it go crazy there, let's just say like an 8.0, it could create a tsunami because it's right there at the shoreline, all right? So I just want to keep you guys posted. Canada just got hit five earthquakes between 4.0 to 4.7.